53 long years of being held captive in a tiny space to be used for entertainment by the human race, captured from her home while she was still just an infant, to spend her entire life performing for contingents, known to many as Lolita and to others as Takate, another once free orca who spent her life as a slave. Could you even imagine being in her situation, taken from your pod, your home, to a strange location, forced to spend almost all your days inside a tiny little cell, with barely any room to turn and nobody hears you yell, until you are required of again, another crowd to please, and you get a glimpse of sunshine, you finally feel the breeze, you're not out there to enjoy yourself, you're there to please them, adults whistle and children scream as your instructions are given, another now on your back and you have no choice but to be ridden, as the same weight you carry decides on how much food you're given, in control of literally every single aspect of your life, over half a century they take from you and still not satisfied. There were many against this however and they campaigned for years, yet money it seems outweighs morality and they all fell on deaf ears. There was talk of a re-release but it never actually materialised, as politics were being discussed, your health further now declines, sealing your fate indefinitely you would leave this world imprisoned. On the 18th of August the news came out, you are no longer with us. And so I shed a tear for you Lolita, and sincerely apologise, that the only way you were ever set free, was because you closed your eyes. <laughs>